guys i'm michelle jerry um <laughs> i'm a student at grand valley state university and i'm pursuing my masters in cyber security so um i've been raised in chogoria that's in meru county as a small kid as a small kid i was so what do i say nilikuwa mtundu sana yeah. Like hata sikuwa napenda kusoma. Mimi nilikuwa na mshua niende shule the next day nasikia kuambia shu yangu nimeachana na masomo. But nikangangana na kum... design ilikuwa mtundu ni nakumbuka kuna siku nilena kakata viti zake zote. Ndio niona hizi viti zimetengenezwa na nini. Penye mtoto kuwa curious. Hadi kuna siku pengine niliua kuku zake zote. Alikuwa ameka fertilizer kwa nyumba ya kuku. Mimi kadhani ni chakula. Oh sorry kufi kufi hizo kuku kazi feed asubuhi nasikia shango na piga nduru kuku zake zimeuliwa anyway but ni, nilisoma nika nilichangeiwa mashule primary yeah. nikapelekwa chogoria bodin mm-hmm. oh ilikuwa chogoria junior nikaenda yeah. mariamu bodin hapo ndo nilikuwa shift yeah because tulikuwa tunachapwa kasi hiyo kuchapwa si nani ningekuwa shift well yeah So nikaenda high school, nikaenda Chogoria Girls High School, nikasoma. Nakumbuka Chogoria Girls nilikuwa serious pia nilikuwa by then hawako anasema prefect ni secretary. Yeah. Um nikamaliza nilipata B+, nika join KU. KU can introduce to life. When yeah. you when in toto umetoka Meru mzuri, umekuja, umeona kagwara na kamoja. Yeah. <laughs> But nikarudi back to kusoma nikamaliza KU. Yeah. So nilimaliza 2021. Yeah. So nikiendea transcripts zangu KU, nilikuwa nataka kuja kutembelea anti yangu US. Okay. So nikasikia ati una need transcripts kwenda nazo embassy. So nikiziendea KU nikapatana na Humphrey. I met Humphrey from yeah. I think he's in Alabama. Yeah. So um yeye siku alikuwa too noisy, alikuwa na nipo. So I had to like I didn't want anything to do with him because he was talking too much. He was yeah. like this kissy guy. So <laughs> so he approached me and said hi. I was like man, let me just be nice <laughs> and talk back. Yeah. Um so I was like hi too. So um I told him I was coming for my transcripts. We had, we had a chit chat over here and there. Alienda kanibaia lunch. So ndo akanya and kona me free all of a sudden. I'm in pata empower. You are watching Success with Bob Mweti show presented to you by Upstack America. Upstack America is a consulting company that helps immigrants find amazing higher education and job opportunities in the tech industry in the United States. You can find our programs by going to www.upstackamerica.com. Upstack America, we wake you up to the unlimited potential. Ilikuwa hivi ku discover. Yeah. So niko like una need discover nini kwani umeingia watch wash. Like, yeah. Kaniambia pana kuna hii program inaitwa Kenya Airlift program. Wamenipea um nataka kwenda kusoma US. Nishapata discover funding yangu ya kwenda US. So niko hapa ndo nakuja transcripts ke you cuz shule yenye ni apply wanahitaji. I mean mm. like I've tried all this easy my places zote easy wana nitakupeleka US ukasoma bika kwa scam. Yeah. Hii ni true aje. Yeah. But he showed me the the discover letter, yeah. the school acceptance and the day he was going for his interview. Yeah. So I was like, damn, because I I also want to go to the US. Let me try Kenya Airlift program. So that day I called um DMK Um and Humphrey introduced me to DMK. So DMK told me the uh he asked me about my KCC grades cuz it was poor. I was like, yeah, can you ambia soon as I join, but if my grades are good and I want to pursue my masters, I can join the program. So I decided to join KAP. Um under regular, but then I tried nishaifanya vitu kaji mas kitambo and I had failed. So I knew niki end up option ya regular ni nifanye GMAT nita fail tena. Yeah. Tu nimeza ya kufia. Yo GMAT. So ndio nikaenda option ya parallel. So kuingia wakani guide wakani apply ya shule nikapata visa yangu. So so time ya kwenda kwa okay shule kwangu haikuwa much cuz I think Wilfred will come delay kuni apply ya mashule so yeah. we have kukuuliza cuz nikao nikome ni sauti kidogo yeah. but 
finally ukani apply yeah, i think ilikuwa june kila kitu yangu ilingia na june everything is set i got yeah. an admission after four days i got empower after one week and then i had even gotten a date for visa i think it was 23rd august so i didn't have to uh, to wait for a year but yeah. i expedited it and the embassy kaipeleka to 2nd of august so in that period i was waiting while bob was training us for the visa he was coaching us um so yeah so ndo nikaenda hiyo siku nikaamka nikaenda visa kaulizwa naenda kufanya okay hiyo asubuhi na kumka kulikuwa na baridi but from kulikuwa na baridi unaogopa so hiyo yote ikishikana unatetemeka so like this but anyway tukaenda embassy na kumbuka kuna mtu hapo niliona na piana visa sana alikuwa mwanaume so siko nataka kwenda tu the lady that was seated next So nakumbuka hata kinita hiyo lady akinita hivi nikijifanya naangalia huko until mtu wako hapa akahamu kunitap unaitwa <laughs> so I was like man nenda kunyimwa hii kitu but nikaenda um, and the lady asked me some questions um, where are you going to study of course US kanyambia ni mwambie um, shule nenda JSU of course kufanya cyber security and she asked me if I have funding and I said yes so I saw a blue paper I couldn't believe it. I was like, "Oh my god. I didn't know I'd get this visa, but I got it and I said I'm now I'm going to announce to the village. I'm going to the US." And so I made a call to my grandma and I was like, "Let me okay, in Kimeru na Kajojo, kuona visa." And she was so happy. Akanyambia, "Now it's time to come back to Meru. I coach you, I counsel you so that when you go to the US, you can be a good lady." So I went to Meru, did counseling. And then now after a week your by uh, Bob got us a plane ticket to come to the US. So I came with two other ladies. Okay, I can't say their names. I don't want them to kill me. So we boarded the plane together. I remember it was my first international flight. Um flight that I had boarded was to Mombasa, Iso. And I think I was I was little but now I'm a grown up and flying to the US. I couldn't believe it. It was a dream come true. You have been watching Success with Bob Mwiti show brought to you by Upstate America. Come back again next time to learn concepts tools, strategies, and resources on the path of becoming a successful immigrant in USA through real-life experiences. Be sure to subscribe to Bob Mwiti channel on YouTube and also follow him on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn.